Hey guys! This is your reading for September 5th through September 12th. And this is who is coming towards you and what do they want? So we're going to take a look and see who, if anybody, what energy is coming towards you guys in the upcoming week. Four cards for Aries. It's coming towards Aries. Hmm. Could be a Scorpio. Somebody that's really trying to make a decision about you guys here. Virgo energy. This could be the same person that has um, Scorpio and Virgo in their chart because somebody's really trying to figure out the best way to or decide what's best in this situation with you guys here. Then you have a King of Wands. Maybe another Aries, Leo. Oh my card. And two of wands. Again, Aries energy. So primarily Aries energy, Virgo, Scorpio energy. Aries and Scorpio kind of almost exhibit the same kind of um, energy. Scorpio is a lot more intense, though. A lot more intense. But um, whoever this is, this two of wands, they know what they want to do. They're just kind of um, not really in stasis. I'm almost feeling like hesitation because they know what they want to do. They're trying to figure out if it's the right thing to do. They're trying to build their confidence as well here. Let's see. What does the Scorpio energy want? What's up with judgment? Please show me more about judgment. What do they want? Huh. They're planning something for sure. And wanting to come back. But this is a very slow moving energy here. This this and this energy right here is kind of calculating. And they need to have like this um this assurance that things are gonna, you know, go in their favor, I feel. Please show me more of the hermit. Knight of Cups. This person's looking for the one. They're ready to be in love. Whoever this Virgo energy is, and I'm I'm feeling like this person goes back and forth. This could be three or four different people but it could also be just one person that is going through this because it's like this person is um, they don't want to make they don't want to mess up they don't want to be rejected they want to be quite sure that approaching you is what they want they fill it with the hermit energy here there's something that has awakened in them and they are um, they're wanting like the gusto out of life and they're concentrating on you heavily whoever this is they're wanting to compromise they're wanting to work with you guys here Capricorn energy please show me more about the king of wands the eight of cups somebody is coming back or somebody has come back already There's at least two people here. Somebody that, you know, felt they may be leaving something else behind, someone behind, and um, coming towards you guys because you are where they feel the most emotional fulfillment. They should be more about the Two of Wands. Justice. Again. Whoever this is, they know what they want to do. They're just really uh, trying to make sure it's the right thing to do. Right for them. Right for you. So, I feel like there's two people here. 
one is has like Scorpio Gemini and the other is a fire sign like yourself that probably has like Pisces um, Libra in their chart this person's iffy like this is more of um, Gemini type of energy here to be honest with you and it could very well be a Gemini um, or have Gemini strongly in their chart because the Knight of Pentacles and the Knight of Cups they have their backs to each other and they're T totally different types of energy the Knight of Pentacles is very slow paced and it takes them forever to decide what they're gonna do and get there the Knight of Cups is in a hurry they're ready to offer. They're ready to tell you that they love you. So it's like they're in two minds, whoever this is. This King of Wands is somebody that's coming back. Somebody that was in your life before that's coming back. This person is too. But I feel like this person has made a decision along the way as far as somebody else is concerned. And coming back your way. This person walked away from you too once upon a time, but this person's coming back. What do they want with Aries? What do they want with Aries? Look at this. Did I not call it? Gemini energy. They want to be with you. They want to be with you. But they also want to know that you choose them. And I think that's why they're going back and forth. Because they want you, they want to make sure that they won't get rejected. That whatever um, plan that they have in place is going to work for them in their favor. So this person definitely loves you and wants to be with you over here. What does this person want with Aries? What does this person want with Aries? Something want to flip over there. What does this person want with Aries? And then you have a Knight of Wands right here. Um, <laughs> you know, right now what this person wants I feel is to like they're very sexually attracted to you this person really wants to be with you in a physical way but I do get the sense that since they left another situation that was um, really not fulfilling them emotionally and coming back towards your way that this could develop into something more because they're coming here as the king of wands this person wants to move forward with you and progress, I feel, very fast on this side. Okay, guys? So that is what I have for you. On this side, we have quite quite possibly a Gemini that has like Scorpio, Virgo, Taurus, um, water. Just this person is, to me, feeling like they've gone through a transformation. So however you knew them before, I feel like this person's changed a great deal over here. This person over here does not have any earth in their chart. Okay, so it's on the table rather, in the cards right now. So I don't get the sense of stability with this person yet. This person may have just moved here as well. Um, yeah, because they've left a place and they're coming into you or have come into you and um, there's a possibility that this person's not stable not really not stable that's not the word I'm looking for um, if they've moved from a different location maybe they are at a point where they're trying to get acclimated or reacclimated to where they have moved to currently and they may not have a permanent location is what I'm looking for. So 
that is this energy over here. This is more grounded. This is more love right now. Somebody that really truly loves you, wants you, and wants you to choose them. This person right here has a very strong sexual attraction to you, but I feel like this person wants more from you than just a sexual um, escapade, okay? So that's what I have for you guys, and I'll be speaking with you soon. Oh, we have Pisces, Libra. I feel Aries, Leo energy here. Could be Sagittarius as well on this side, okay? All right, guys.